Welcome to another edition of the Macro Minute. I'm Jeffrey Cleveland, Chief Economist at Payton Regal Investment Management. This week, it's Janet Yellen's data dashboard. The market was a little disappointed this morning, the release of the March jobs report. It showed 192,000 jobs created in March. We weren't that disappointed because that's sort of right in the middle of the 175,000 to 200,000 channel we've been in for the better part of the last three years, dating back to 2011. Perhaps earlier this year, we saw a little bit of weather-induced effects that were pushing down job growth, but now we seem to be back in that channel. And Janet Yellen, who spoke on Monday, suggested, and, and we agree, investors should look beyond that headline non-farm payroll number and look at another array or a wider variety of indicators. She points out a handful in her speech they include average hourly earnings, job growth, the higher rate, the level of job openings, and the labor force participation rate. And here's the key. All of those things, they haven't really improved in the last year. Certainly not enough to change Fed policy. We think for now they're comfortable keeping Fed funds at zero given the environment and then rethinking it if, this, if those indicators improve out over the next 12 months. They're in no rush to lift the Fed funds rate. With the Macro Minute, I'm Jeffrey Cleveland.